Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell. Popular entertainer Capleton has been granted bail in the sum of $250,000 on a rape charge. Capleton, whose real name is Clifton Bailey, made his first appearance in the Kingston and St. Andrew Parish Court this morning, four days after the 51-year-old was charged by a detective at the Center for Investigation of Sexual Offenses and Child Abuse, Sisoka. And Capleton's lawyer is accusing Sisoka detectives of failing to properly investigate rape allegations against his client. They went to the scene and they were told certain things that contradicted the, the complainant's account. They should have taken statement from those witnesses and present it to the authorities. Seven out of every ten Jamaicans are firmly against abortion, but an equal number are adamant that it is the woman's right to determine if she is going to terminate an unwanted pregnancy and not the government's. The results are contained in the latest Gleaner Bill Johnson poll on abortion in Jamaica. The PNP is expressing concern over the selection of Khadija Campbell as the new head of the management unit of the Constituency Development Fund. The PNP says it is not clear that due process was followed in appointing Campbell, who is the Prime Minister's former personal assistant. In sports, Jamaica Football Federation General Secretary Dalton Wynn says Jamaican football clubs are not far off from the stipulations required by CONCACAF to see that the sport across the region becomes more professional and regulated as of next year. In your currency trading today, one U.S. dollar was being sold for $126.07, the British pound sterling for $168.33, and the Canadian dollar for $99.19. .19. In your weather forecast, on Tuesday morning, expect showers across eastern parishes. In the afternoon, there will be isolated showers and thunderstorms across central and western parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.